Morning, everyone. Steve Georgie here from Allendale's Trading Floor. It is October 10th. Been waiting for this October report. Well, it's here. Um, that's what the focus is going to be on here today. And uh, what kind of numbers are we going to see? This report gets released at 11 o'clock this morning. So we're going to be answering a lot of questions on where are we going to be here at 11? Is the markets going to be higher or lower? Well, right now we're certainly seeing some risk off mentality across the markets. Corn's down about four to five cents right now. Beans down nine to ten. Wheat down about three and a half. So we're seeing this risk off mentality with the dollar that had strengthened yesterday. So well off of the lows, up another 30 cents here today, keeping pressure over the commodities in general. So uh, we're still seeing some pressure from that. Now, some of the expectations for this report, looking for production numbers for corn, just over a 14.5 billion crop. Beans, we're looking just under a 4 billion crop is the average trade guess. Uh, as far as yields, we're looking for a three bushel increase for corn and about a bushel increase on beans. That's going to put corn just under 175, and it's going to have soybeans uh, just above one uh, or uh, just above 47.5. So watch for these numbers. But the big thing to, to keep an eye on is going to be carry out. They're going to move some acreage. They're going to move yields. But watch carry out. That's going to have to be, that's going to give us kind of the ending tail. Where are we going to be? They're looking for about 128 million bushel increase for corn. That's going to leave carry out at 2.13. Uh, as far as beans, looking for just a slight reduction of about 3 million. So uh, a lot of that being offset from the quarterly stock numbers that we had seen and, and what we've carried in from last year. Uh, so expecting to see a carryout number about 472 is what the trade is looking for. And then for wheat, uh, right at 704. So look for that. That will be the primary focus today. That does come out at 11 o'clock. Looking at uh, at livestock, cattle right now down about 35 cents. We saw that market reverse yesterday. Feeders uh, finding some pressure as well. But we did see some cash trade, 164. Uh, that's $2 higher than last week's trade, uh, but the market reacted a little bit disappointing. Box beef, though, coming in a little bit higher. Choice up 51, select up 37, but we'll see how we finish out today. Looking at the hogs, down 75 cents for December. Cutout values down just eight cents, uh, but we've we've seen some resistance areas hit uh, as well for the hogs. Um, so we'll see where it goes. But we do have the October contract going off the board next Tuesday, and uh, it does seem like it's in line with the cash here at the moment. Some of the outside markets, stock market very disappointing day yesterday, down 74 once again uh, here this morning. Gold dropping back two bucks right now. Silver down about nine cents. And as I mentioned, that dollar, the dollar is very strong, up about 32 right now, continuing to climb and well off the lows that we had seen from yesterday morning. Please give us a call if you guys have any questions whatsoever. Reach us here at 800-262-7538 or check us out on the web at allendale-inc.com. Hope you guys have a great day. We'll talk to you on Monday. Take care.